Hey, what is going on guys? It's CK here and today welcome back to Forza 6 where we're going to be doing a brand new custom cars episode and it's going to be on this, the Mitsubishi Evo 9 MR. So since we are making a drift build out of this thing guys, rear wheel drive would make the most sense. Now, I know you can still drift in four wheel drive if you have that converted to that, but it just doesn't feel right for me. I'm more of a rear wheel drive drifter, so yeah, we ain't going to fiddle about with the body panels. I'm not too sure. What would a side skirt look like? Yeah, I think we'll go for the side skirt. I mean, the BBS rims and everything, that suits it so well already. I really don't want to mess with it because the Evo 9 MR is just... Oh, oh, it's good. It's Sean's Evo. It is Sean's Evo, so... Yeah, I ain't gonna freaking mess around with that, so... Right now, guys, I just want to say thank you so much. Thank you so much for the support on that video that I put out with Blair or Tiger Riddle. <laughs> yeah, that's his, that's his persona name, yeah. He's a furry as well, so woo! Yeah! Um, but yeah, thank you so much for all the nice comments and stuff. And to all the haters, you know what you can do. You know what you can do, so... Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, 265's in the rear. I don't really know. I don't really know. 275's. We'll put 275's on it, because due to past experience with the M3 GTR, it does get a bit of a handful. It does get a bit of a handful. So, yeah, as I said, we're going to keep this like a stance ish build. Kind of like a stance show car build mixed with a drift build. So, I do want like a deep dish rim. Certainly do for this thing. Oh, God, no. Jesus. No, thank you, my friend. No, thank you. I don't know why I like these, but I like them. Oh, my God. They're really, really good. ET drag from Mickey Thompson. Now, I know it's meant to be a drift build, but that suits it very well. You don't see a lot of evils with these sorts of rims, so we're going to go for it. I know some people might not like it, but I think it suits it quite well, especially the size they're at right now. We might bump up one. Um, hold on a second. 17's away. We'll just keep it at 17's. Well, 18's actually. We'll keep it at 18's because it just sits right. Look at that. That is gorgeous. I mean, to my eye, it is beauty. It is absolutely beautiful. As they say, beauty is in the eye of the beholder. So, yeah, I just realized and I've just found out I'm off for the rest of the week, guys. So, yeah, I just phoned up my work earlier this morning and asked if they put me in for any shifts because I was originally meant to be off Thursday to Thursday, you know, Thursday last week and to today which is Thursday, so they basically told me, oh yeah, we put you off Friday and Saturday as well, so fucking booyaka, booyaka, I got two more days off, so woohoo, man, woohoo, so I've got some Copperbergs, you know, the drink that I like down the stairs in the fridge, I was going to take one right now, but I'm like, it's 12 o'clock in the freaking afternoon on a Thursday, <laughs> you ain't an alcoholic, man, you ain't, you ain't an alcoholic, so, hmm, let's see, so, wait a second, are they red still? Yeah, they are. You can you can barely see it because it is such like a uh, covered up rim. So yes, really really do like this car so far. Oh, look at that! Oh, mummy, mamma mia! That looks so good when it's slim, man. Uh, let me know in the comments, guys. What's your favourite edition of the Evo? This is possibly mine. It is possibly mine because it's just that front end. I really like it. Really do like it, but I also like the Evo 10 and like some of the older Evos as well. I'm kind of on on the fence at which one I like the most, but yeah, as I said, let me know in the comments below. While you're down there, share the video around as well. Share the video around and also check out the BAC Mono like, test drive I done last night. We'll come up on the screen right now, so once that video's done, go check it out. Link will be in the description as well, so... That's basically all of the handling and bits done, so we're going to see what she gets in terms of power. Now, stock power in this thing was 286 horsepower and about 289 pounds feet of torque, so it's quite a torquey car, but not much on the power side, but that has all changed now. 661 horsepower, 548 pounds feet of torque, and a weight of 2,527 pounds. So let's get this thing out on a try. I don't know what I'm going to pick yet. It will be a surprise for you guys. So let's go. Surprise! It's white. It looks so nice and white. I've always been a fan of Evo 9s in white. Especially when their ride height has been lowered, which I've just done in the tuning setup. I've not fiddled about with the differential or anything like that. It's just 
Um, negative one camber front and rear and the suspension is all the way slammed but wow freaking wow so as you can see by the building right behind us we are at silverstone right now and i've not done this in a video yet so far in forza 6 so yeah let's hear how she sounds love the turbo whistle love the turbo whistle man can't beat it so, this interior is really, really good as well. Proper rally car steering wheel. So, it feels really, really light, even by turning that there. So, anyway, let's get going. Jesus! Bloody hell, that is crazy! That tire spot we were producing there is unreal. Come on, baby. Get sideways for me. God, I still feel the front end grip, even though I've converted it to like rear wheel drive, man. Still there. Maybe should have kept that in third there for that corner. God damn it, fourth. This thing is so good. It is so good. I mean. There's no point in it wants to spin out, which I like in my drift cars, so you can easily just turn it around. Look at this shit. Third gear, a little bit on the brake there just to slow it down. Oh god, okay, that was my fault. Right, we'll give this corner another little go. <laughs> Sorry about that guys, I don't know what happened, I might have just let off the gas a little bit too quickly there. I love this section in Silverstone, man. So good. Nice S section. You really do need to work the throttle with this car though, that's the one thing you might be noticing. I'm going on and off the gas like freaking crazy. Come on baby, come on. That's it, that's it. Yeah, serious face game time now, oh my god. Because a lot of you guys have been saying, properly focus on the drifting and don't make us laugh. Well, I want to make you guys laugh, I want to make you enjoy yourselves right, but I know a lot of you come here for the actual like gameplay but <laughs> holy shit seriously I just wanna have fun man I just wanna have fun and talk to you but in this in this situation today I think I'm needing to concentrate a little bit this is such a good track man I mean they have made some changes over the years to Silverstone okay I was a wee bit wrong that time just clipped the curb on that one there holy crap that's it now but as I was saying they have made some changes over the years to the Silverstone circuit. There are some corners that are there now that weren't there before, so... They're nice additions. I ain't complaining. I really ain't complaining, because we went for some nice drift sections. This is one of my favourites, this bit here. Down into third gear will do it. Kick the clutch. Little tap the brake again. Boy, yeah, it's a lot more smoother now. We attempt second gear for this bit. It's a lot wider than I remember. It's a lot wider this bit. Come on, come on. Sorry if I'm biting my lip. I'm like, mm. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I just noticed what I was doing. I'm like, mm. God's sake, but this thing is special. This thing is a really special car, man. Yes, mate. We'll kick it into. Some cockpit view action! Yeah! God, the t I just realised how small the steering wheel is! I like it! I like it! I'm pretty sure this is a... Is it a... What is this? Is it a sparkle steering wheel? It certainly looks like a sparkle steering wheel! Oh, yes! You selling that sparkle steering wheel? Hell no! I even pay retail for it! God damn! That's one of my favourite lines from that movie, man, Tokyo Drift. Yes! Whoo! Man, this is so good. I mean, I know this edition of the Evo is coming back in the NFS 2015, so God, I can only imagine what it's going to be like to customise that thing in that game. It's going to be insane. Here again. Let's not fuck up this time, Frankie boy. Let's not do it this time. It, it transitions so well, but as you've seen a couple of times, it does like to spin. Tiny bit, even though I said earlier on it doesn't feel like it wants to spin, but it's one of them cars you really need to like watch out for because it can just do it at any time. Although it doesn't feel like it. 
That's the thing, that's a strange thing. Ooh, yeah. So let me know in the comments below, guys, what other cars do you want me to build? Also, let me know some, like, series ideas you want me to do, just, like, any videos at all. Thanks for all the suggestions so far, by the way. I've got them all written down, seriously. I've got a freaking page full of ideas, man, so... They'll be coming over time, guys. They'll be coming over time, because I know a lot of you have been asking for me to build your cars. I know there's been a lot of people asking for the RS7, you know, the Audi RS7. I'm definitely going to be doing that soon. Um, some Gymkhana builds will be coming as well, so... Yeah, just leave it in the comments and I will get back to the men. So, I've been diving deep into the comments over the past few nights, seriously. I've basically get back to every single person. And that is what I like doing, man. This shows that I actually give a shit, unlike some people. I'm not meaning to brag or anything, but if you're doing YouTube, you should be in the comments interacting with your fans. But, I don't really, I don't want to say fans because it's a fucking, it's a weird way. I would basically call you my friends, basically, so... Yeah, I don't know what you guys would make of that, but, yeah, <laughs> you watch my videos every day, so technically you are my friend, so, yeah, although you can't see me, oh, you, can, you can see me, I can't see you, but, you know what I mean, man, the love is there, the love is there, yes it is, oh god, she's getting frisky, na 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 na, na 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 na, and the thing I always do, you gotta go backwards, shit. I was trying to burn out, but just went there. It's like no way, okay. We're not, we're not doing that today. We're just going to die on you. It's like bleh. <laughs> Third gear. Keep it going a little bit, baby. Keep it going. Maybe into second, yeah. Second would do for this bit. Just hope it doesn't snap at this bit. There we go. That's it. That's it. Whoa! I know it's what you were doing there, evil. Don't you pull that move on me. I don't go down that easily. I really don't. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, when you get in a rhythm with this thing, it is so smooth. It is so damn smooth now. Um, I don't know, is it the 18th today? I think it is the 18th, I'm not too sure, but it may be tomorrow, but if you guys have got fours or six, what do you make of it? Seriously, because I know a lot of people have been saying, oh, I can't wait to get the game and just start drifting and stuff. Seriously, you guys, if you've not already got the game yet, you are going to love it. Seriously, it's so much better than Forza Motorsport 5. And obviously, it's a wee bit more difficult to drift on this game than Horizon 2, because for that game, you can drift anything. <laughs> you can drift anything without barely any ease. Barely any effort, that's what I'm trying to say, so... Whoa, whoa, baby, don't do that. Fuck! That's it, honestly. As soon as you hit them carbs, you're going down. Yeah! <laughs> oh, it's so much fun. So much fun, this thing. I think this is the last couple of sections, and then we're going to round off the video, guys. Keep it in fourth. Yeah, this, is, this is the old one. This is the old section back in Forza 4. Memories! Are coming back, people. Oh man, don't fuck it up now. Yes, that was good. That was really good. So, anyway, guys, we're gonna end off here for this episode of Custom Cars. Let me know in the comments below what you make of my custom. Evo 9 MR is a very, very, very good car. I was ready to turn left there, but I forgot. It's new. It's new on Silverstone now, but... Oh, man, I'm in love with it. I'm in love with it, seriously. And thank you, Turn 10, for actually bringing this version back, because... The old Evo, the old Evo 8, I do like it, right? But just the front end on this thing is so aggressive and so fine-looking at the same time, so... Anyway, guys, if you've enjoyed it, then please do leave it a like. Much appreciated. It just shows me that you're enjoying the videos and just makes me happy. It really does put a smile on my face. <laughs> it puts a smile on my face. Yeah, Sean Connery, yeah. It puts a smile on my face. But, yeah. Also, sub to the channel and share it around, as I said. So, yeah. I will see you in the next video of mine, which is going to be coming up later tonight. For me and Evil, peace. That noise, though. <laughs>